A Wabash Valley family marks the anniversary of a soldier's death. Sergeant Kyle Childress was killed in Iraq five years ago today. As News 10's Ron Verrell Moore tells us, his family is celebrating Kyle's life, hoping others won't forget other fallen heroes. Ron Drell. Mark Patrice, Sergeant Kyle Childress, died while serving in Operation Iraqi Freedom on this day in 2005. His death marked the very first soldier in Vigo County to be killed in that war. Now five years later, his family says he still lives on in their hearts, and they want his legacy to continue. And you know, most kids, when they get scared, they cover their eyes. Scary movie. Well, he always would cover his ears and say, I'm not scared to look at it, I just don't want to hear it. One of the many childhood memories this sister wants to keep. Pictures, records, even quilts, all working to maintain the memory of her brother, Sergeant Kyle Childress. Well, to be in the fifth year, it's... um. Like you have a lot of days that are healing days, and you have days that are pretty sorrowful. The family able to get some healing as they gather around his grave, placing balloons as a tribute, something that's been done each year since his death. Well, I think about him every day. It's, it's not like it's five years old. It's like it was just happened today. So. The Childress family isn't seeking any sympathy. They just want folks to remember their hero. He's still my quiet little shy brother to me, but... I know he turned out to be an excellent man and a wonderful soldier, a hero for all of us. The Childress family says they again would like to thank the community for supporting not only them, but everyone who lost a loved one overseas. Back to you. Thanks, Ron Drell.